It's time! You ready to fight? Ready. ready. All right, so the fight is now underway. We'll see how long it goes. You've got a submission specialist on one side and on the other side. Maybe the most well-rounded fighter in this world. Yeah, he is one of the best fighters in the entire UFC. But in front of him, he has one of the most dangerous fighters across all divisions in the octagon because that one skill he has is so good that you're, un you're in danger the entire time. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. Right hook to the head blocked. Connects with a right. Look at the skip action that allows you to land that big knee. DC didn't take him long to find his range here tonight, huh? His timing is on point. Ooh, what a punch. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Single collar tie now. Now connects with a right. What a punch. Combination lands for him. He is really putting the strikes together tonight. I mean, he's feeling himself tonight, John. He's doing a great job of putting everything together. Two minutes have expired here in our opening round. Look at him working at trying to shut the lid out. Outstanding output on both sides. He is all about that left kick to the body. Lee's head kick is blocked, so no damage inflicted there. Punch over the top. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Oh, he did a great job of rotating him into an underhook. Just missed on the high kick there. Nice head kick. Absolutely punished by that head kick. Got the single collar tie. Nice leg kick lands. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by him. Oh, that was a big takedown. Is this the one that's going to break him? All right, bottom fighter here. Maybe looking to hip escape, DC. All right, he's hanging out inside the closed guard of his opponent here, DC. You gotta be careful. All right, so he's got his head here looking to set up the guillotine choke now. Oh, he's stuck in the guillotine. Oh, we're getting a finish here. Oh, look at this. Jumps over in the side mount to try to counter the guillotine. Maybe going with that Von Flew choke, or I guess we should probably call it the OSP at this point. Get out of there. Wow. All right, full guard now, DC. And for the guy on top, he needs to build posture or just go to the next position, start shoving that knee through, trying to get the half guard, which in turn will lead to more opportunities for advancement. But if you're on the bottom, you need to be anticipating.
you need to be framing, you need to be moving, looking for opportunities to either reverse the position or get back to your feet. Right hook attempt, that's a miss. Oh, he got him with too. Oh, nice punch there by Lou. Goes back to that left kick once again. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC, and if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, man, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. All right, next round is underway, DC. We talked about his powerful kicks, how he attacks all sides of the body, the head, the legs. Pretty good stuff for him. That was so impressive to see. Someone fight almost predominantly with their legs and have that level of success. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Well, he's looking for that left hand just out of range, though, with it. Good punch, Lance. He engages in the single collar tie. And they separate. Ooh, blocks the shot. Again, they clinch. Like single collar tie. That is how you scramble, folks. Oh, Superman punch. Not always easy to execute. He did so there. Connects with a right hand, pretty good punch, that one. Nice right punch by this young man. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. Look at him chop. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. <laughs> Telegraph that spinning back fist. Oh, straight right. Can't take many of those. You better check. Oh, another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. He didn't like that left hand. Some real power shots here. Use hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Well, defense doesn't necessarily win championships in MMA, but he's doing a nice job blocking these shots. He's not allowing his opponent to get any damage off on him by blocking all these attacks. And both guys really throwing with authority. Nice strike. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body up. Oh! He's done! He's done! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's gotta press him. He's gotta go chase that finish down now. Oh, big left hook there. Head kick attempt is blocked. Starting to do some really significant damage. To oh! Kick there by Lee. Switching stances here. Well, they've made all the right reads here tonight, and there's another one. Beautiful read on the leg strike as he catches it and then returns fire with a punch of his own. So they have got the timing down here at this point of the fight. Lee gets caught with that punch, and they separate. Man, is he timing his shots well here tonight, DC. It's hard to recall him being this accurate in the past. I mean, he is so sharp. And not only is he accurate, he's also keeping very busy. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Big kick land. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is a funny shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. Well, at this point, he's got to be way up on the judges' scorecards, clearly winning the fight, and 
largely has gotten it done with his striking team. He got it done with his oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come with me without a combo. I want the whole platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to hold behind it. Lees has got full mount now. Maybe so have we, your winner by TKO. That was a great performance. Way to land those strikes and go and chase down the finish when you get an opportunity. Right, let's re the highlight now, DC, and he's certainly going to enjoy watching this one back. The head kick was there early, it was there often, and ultimately ended the night for his opponent. He found a weakness in his opponent's game. The left kick. Over and over, he was able to land it. And he was landing the strikes, too, with his hands. But ultimately, it was the kick that was hidden behind the punch that finished the fight for him. First Buffer has your official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest. At four minutes, 50 seconds of round number two, declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon. There is the man of the moment, and what a moment this must be like for a professional athlete, right? I know you enjoyed the birth of your kids, right? But yeah. you knock out a man in a cage fight, I can't think of anything better. I mean, there's nothing like it. You know, you don't even hear the one that lands that puts out your opponent's lights. And tonight, he got that done. And he should be 